Good morning, you chill out. I'm your host, CK31. I'm back for an episode. Hey, right now, I am going to be reviewing the Jurassic World Mini Dino Multi Pack 15 Pack Mini Dino Battle Damage Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. And yes, I did not actually know what it was called, so I just read the little labels there and I just kind of mixed it up in my head. So, yeah. So, this is actually pretty cool. Ages for three and up. Three and up. That's me! And this is the actual size of the dinosaur. And, <coughs> and on the back, there is, you can, in this entire lining, if this thing could actually focus, you could get the Mosasaurus Rexy, or the Tyrannosaurus Rex, the Metrocanthosaurus, Triceratops, Indoraptor, Stegosaurus, Baryonyx, Dilophosaurus, Stigimolex, Stiggy, Velociraptor Blue, Apatosaurus, Allosaurus, Indominus Rex, Carnotaurus, and Pteranodon. Good blimey, I am never going to say that ever again. <laughs> so, I don't even really need to be right back here. Let me just, like, rip this thing over. See? Just like that. It's as easy as that. I have got to, they had to put tape on this thing. It was as e easy as that. Easy. I said easy as that. Okay. Ouch. My fingers hurt a lot now. They, like with the little blind bags, you could get like this. And then you could have like a little checklist of all the things that you got. And they come in like something like this, but they don't worry. They they they're terraforming. If you do not see the man of steel, then you have no idea what you saw. Damn, God! Oh my God! So much freaking tape! It's ridiculous. How much tape do they need to use on for these things? Okay. Bleh! Okay. First off, I'm gonna kinda go like from left to right here in my view. So first I'm gonna read, take a look at the Metro oh god, the Metro Canthosaurus. Looks pretty cool, it's just solid plastic with a little battle damage thingy right there. It doesn't really have an articulation, but it's like rubber, like like bended. But anyway, Metric at the source. Pretty cool. I like it. You can stab perfectly, which is good. Next is the Stitchy Bullock. I kind of wish that they added, like, a little bit more paint besides just a big... It's just a big orange blob. And it does... Surprisingly, it has no battle damage. Which is weird. Next, I have the Allosaurus. With some battle damage. Pretty cool. Gonna line them all up here. Next is the Pteranodon. Squawk, squawk, squawk. There we go. And next is the. <coughs> Is the Apatosaurus? I am dying today. I think the tail on this should be kind of, kind of a bit longer. It should come to more of a point because it's kind of like it looks like it's just been chopped off right there. Next is this Stegosaurus, a big green ice cream cone headed thing I do love the detailing on these and next is the next is the Indoraptor I almost wanted to say Indominus Rex so this is pretty cool it's got that nice little standard like pose like it did, did or does did does did I don't care, it's the same thing. Next is the Triceratops. Looking pretty cool. And now we are on to the next pail.
which has Velociraptor Blur. I wish that the striping would go all the way up. It doesn't do that. Tail. I wish it would. And for some reason, freakishly huge feet. My god, I did not I did not know Blue had such big feet. Okay, next is the Baryonyx. Once I get like some of the blind boxes that I could kind of compare these more better, because I don't really have anything to compare these guys with. And next is one of the coolest ones here, the Indominus Rex. It's a cool... <coughs> oh my god, my dying today is this cool little transparent piece of plastic. So you could kind of like replicate it as if it was like blending in. And next is Rexy. Does she actually have a raptor's purse? Uh, I thought she did. But never mind. Rexy. Very, very, very cool. And don't worry, I will compare all these guys' sizes once I am done getting all these out and then just reviewing them bit by bit. And this is the Dilophosaurus. Pretty, pretty cool. And next is Captain Goofy, aka Carnotaurus. Kind of just fly there. Oh, good. Oh, okay, and he will not move. He will not stand. Well, okay, there we go. And finally is the Mosasaurus, which surprisingly is the only one here that has an articulated mouth. Which is honestly kind of goofed up a little bit. <laughs> Only even has like the second row of inner teeth right there. Just cool. And this thing feels bulky too. Like, yeesh! It's like it's bulky! And... Uh, wait. I'll just be right back momentarily. Okay, well I did my best. To kind of try to s do this, but it's kind of difficult. Fifteen of these little boogers, but <coughs> <coughs> these things, I believe. Oh, whoops! I forgot the Dilophosaurus. Oops! I just put them next to the stego. I believe these things. Are can be pretty cool to like play with. Like you can have like a Dominus Rex here, Mosasaurus, boom, nom, 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 ah. And then you can like have these guys like fight, like like how they did in the movie. Okay, now I'm getting too carried away. <laughs> For some reason, now I'm noticing this, but the Indominus Rex has also, like, freakishly huge feet. Let me move the camera. It's freakishly huge feet. Okay. So I got that out of the way. Now, for the Indoraptor, the kind of the main one here. It's pretty cool, but I some of these things are a little bit too like a little bit too wobbly. Hi, a tiny bit too wobbly, I think. So that may cause some issues, but otherwise not very much, really. Anything besides maybe like a little bit of extra paint, I would probably say. But the detailing on these are pretty gosh dang good for little minifigures. I basically love all these things. Because you can have them 
all basically just like actual like how they were like like look at this especially with the battle damage you remember this it's killing for sport so that's what I kind of think of where you could kind of go with this is basically what I'm trying to say and you can have like blue like attacking this little indoraptor here and like Oh god, I, I please leave a like to help this to help me. And so basically I that is it for this video. So if you enjoy this video, leave a like, comment, and subscribe to come part of the Spider Kingdom. Hasta la vista. Boys and girls, good boy.